second fishing session of the day. Oh, and I'm in a new spot actually. And I've been here about half an hour. And as you can no doubt see from the limited view on the screen, I'm into a decent fish. In fact, I've got the phone resting on my rucksack. So it's about improvisation as far as that's concerned. I'll tell you what though, it's a, it's a tench hopefully because that's what I'm after this evening. It is indeed. Let's get this in the net. It might not be a big fish by the standards of the gravel pits and estate lakes that I do fish from time to time. But I'll tell you what, from the venue, this is fantastic. And I'll tell you more about that in due course. I'm fishing again now, so I'm holding the iPhone while I watch the rod tip. I'm only here for a very short time. I did some groundwork, small pond, very weedy, but I cast around with a lead and found a clear spot. That's what you want, isn't it? And I thought I'll come back to this place Obviously, that's why I was having a look in the in the in the first instance, but I'll come back and target, hopefully, some tench, because it does look very tenchy. And there you go, I've got one, haven't I? And when you do get fish like that under those circumstances, it does bring a lot of pleasure. The mouth was perfect as well. That's always a good sign, isn't it? So often you catch fish from popular venues and the mouths are ripped apart that one I mean I can't say it's never been caught that's perhaps too bold a statement but if I say it hasn't I wouldn't be surprised if that's not true anyway I've put the bait out there again I'm fishing with a single grain of corn on a size 12 hook it's a quarter of an ounce lead that gets me out there I'm fishing with a, a quiver tip obviously and I've put some brown crumb and sweet corn out there. Not too much, because I don't know what the density of the fish will be. In fact, you don't know what's in some of these places until you give them a go, do you? Just a, a short session as well, because I've been this morning. And I thought, well, you can never have too much of a good thing, can you? And that most certainly is true as far as fishing's concerned. It's a nice roach. 